green is the gray one. Nice. So well, that's a little big. It is a little big, but it, it'll it'll work. That's it'll work. It, oh, oh, it just fell off. Oh man! Take two because I'm an idiot. Way to sun. This is part two of the his and hers Dollar Tree haul. This is the his portion. Deja this vu. I know. It's like I've done this before. Matrix uh, screwed this up. This is the part that he bought. The stuff that he bought. And I had 19 items in mine. He has 38. Somewhere around there, yeah. Ish. Ish. Um. So I, t I told you guys once. You just weren't listening apparently. You just weren't paying attention. I'm just kidding. I had forgotten to hit record. <laughs> so Hubby buys monthly candy like stuff. Like he and then he chomps on it throughout the month. I don't think he bought any in February. I haven't bought yeah. Sometimes and, I go two months or so. Until without, today, which is St. Patrick's Day, you hadn't bought any for March. Yeah. Excuse me again. So this is his candy partially I mean you'll see his candy and then other stuff that he got but I'm not starting with candy so why I started the haul with that I don't know but it happens so the first thing he bought was this Pillsbury cheddar garlic biscuit mix just add milk so hey you gotta write that <laughs> I know I said first time I said just add water and I swear I read water but we don't have milk so why did you get something that just add milk because I wanted that, I wanted to taste those biscuits, so I'll get some milk. So anyway, there's that. And he also purchased, which is not candy, more of these low main Asian noodles, which we really liked. So I'm glad he found more of them. He got four. Did a little bit of a stock up on those. He also found some nice, nice sized cans of spices which is the only reason he bought them the smaller cans we won't buy there little jars but this is the supreme tradition garlic and pepper seasoning which we've had before and this is actually a really nice it's got a really nice uh, pepper scent to it and not or flavor to it not too much garlic and he also got the Memphis style barbecue seasoning also something we've had in the past it's just been a little while oh wait a minute sorry I forgot and these are 10.5 ounces. This one's 12. And the garlic, really? That's what it says. And this one's 12. Well, that kind of sucks. Okay, so, moving on. Moving right along. Another one of his favorite purchases for snacks is the sourdough pretzel nibblers by the Snyders. And I love those. Snyders is one of the best pretzel brands ever. I don't care. What was that? Did you hear that? I did. So anyway, uh, one of his favorites, this is also one of his favorite things to purchase. You guys have seen me haul them many times for him. His animal crackers. What makes it a cracker and not a cookie? I say it's a cookie. So, and it's funny that he grabbed this because I almost grabbed one. I love those Just because I'm kind of in the mood for some of these. I really like them too, but I like mine with milk. And like I just said, we're out of milk. So we'll have to fix that. Um, another... I debated on that because it's such a small pack. Yeah. But I love those things. Snyder's Honey Mustard and Onion Pretzel Pieces. So those are kind of cool. I don't, I don't think we've... Have I had those before? The Honey Mustard yes, and Onion? Yes, at one point you had... you Like I bought a bag of them and I didn't then I, get in any of them. I ate them all. Yeah. That's what he gets for only buying one. That's right. Um, He also bought... Now this is a new brand name. I don't think this is a brand name I've ever seen yeah, before. I haven't, I haven't seen them there before either. And they're and bigger than the... They are bigger. It's a bigger package. Yes. Um, It's an 8 ounce package of gummy worms by Crystal Bay Connections. So hold on guys. Let me do a little bit of investigating here. So I watch um, Forensic Files all the time and the guy that narrates that. He says investigating. The investigators. It cracks me up when he says it. Um, Crystal Bay confections or a variety. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where are you from, dudes? Oh, okay. It's a Greenbrier brand. So it's apparently a Dollar Tree brand that they've 
Maybe they've just rebranded it and we've not noticed the packaging before because right now Dollar Tree is going through a lot of rebranding and repackaging. So maybe it's just... Okay, this packaging on this one is just too damn cute. That's another 8-ounce package. And again, it's that Coastal Bay Confections. But it's the gummy bears. But look at this little picture of the gummy bears. God, how cute. So I have little gummy bear stickers. I've had them forever. And I'm 99% sure I got them at Dollar Tree when I got them. I have never seen them since. I would love to get more and do a whole planner page in the gummy bears. <laughs> it's so cute. Look at their little faces with their little arms. You they just want to smooch them. You just want to eat them. And they're, these are pretty. Like, I know that's weird to say. Oh, they're colorful. But it's and pretty. shiny. They're shiny. They're shiny. <laughs> really? He bought this brand? So he also got well, some... There's a reason. Red vines. Yes. And And... And I'll tell you when you pick up the other ones. And some Twizzlers. <laughs> they didn't have Twizzlers in the red. <laughs> okay. So, black licorice, which I hate. I, I love hate black licorice. black licorice. Can't stand the smell of it. Just gross. Red Vines, I don't like this brand. It's too chewy and rubbery. I don't, I don't necessarily care for Red Vines. I would have just gone without. Okay. I would have. I would have said I, I know. not happening. just would have. I just would have. Because I'm a licorice snob that way. <laughs> He also grabbed, and I kind of wish Ooh. I had been thinking ahead a little bit and gone ahead and gotten these two because I wanted That's to get... one for you and one for me. But I wanted to get them for the grands, one, mm. for, one for each of the grands. You know what? I was going to ask you if you wanted to get a basket for all the grandkids, but that's six of them, and I didn't think we could do well, that Well, plus I want to do the others. So that's we, nine. Yeah, well, no, all of the others. Oh, my God. That's another six, I think. Okay. So anyway, he got two of these solid bunnies. And the only reason I didn't say anything is because where we didn't have an extremely tight budget, obviously, we still did have a budget. And today was not about them. <laughs> like, no other nice way to say it. Is this Palmer's? This is Palmer's candy. So this means, oh, I just realized it's got two different color packaging too. So if you're doing like a themed basket, you know, or you've got kiddos, you need to tell the difference you've got two options at least i don't know if there's any others because i didn't really look but anyway um palmers i have to eat in little bits because palmers will actually give me a really bad migraine if i'm not careful hubby got some boston baked beans because he puts his car in, put in a hopper uh good in plenties i love those things mm. mine and violet's favorite and some dots. Sorry, I was trying to avoid a moment. Um, yeah, Violet loved those. All right, now moving on to what is not food. I'm saving those for last because mm -hmm. they're awesome. Right here. So I don't know if you guys watched our live that we did the other night. Hubby was saying how he wanted to get a cup like mine. Now, in the live, you found out that this was a promotional item that I got uh, while I was working at Jackson Street. But have you got this at the Dollar Tree because he wants to start using the ice cubes like I do, which I think is so cute. <laughs> uh, the straw does not have to stay in, which you're not going to use I'm not this. using that straw. Yeah, we're not fans of these straws. <laughs> but it does have easy access opening. It's got two. And that's what I like, easy access. All righty. Um, so, so he can drink out of it. <laughs> and yeah, Love it is BPA-free. And gray, as you can All tell. All the BPA in there is free? All of it. Every bit of it. Awesome. He got some garden gnomies. And I know why. He got them for the trees. I did. I, I know my husband. He loves this stuff. It's go creepy the, to me. Uh, I, I got... That I, one is really creepy. Look at that. I love that one. Ooh, of course you do. If I find it really creepy, hubby is like, yeah. So, yeah. Anyway, such is life. He got two of the garden hooks. Which are going to be? Garden hooks. No. You're going to go. Uh, on... Don't see it. You're probably going to do something over a fire with them. Yeah. Like holding your pot or something. Well, it's going to go like this. One on one side, one on the other. And, you can... and then I'm going to lay my stick over the hooks. Except for those are not strong enough to hold They anything. are because I've used them before. So he also got a package of the smaller uh, metal garden hooks. It's the a two-pack. The S-hooks. 
And those are going to dangle on my stick, which goes over my fireplace. You wish your stick could hold that. <laughs> <laughs> you got one of the larger S hooks. You're adorable. <laughs> so this was kind of funny because he stood there and looked at this for the longest time. He's like, I think I remember needing this to do something, but now I can't remember what I think I needed it for. I'm like, well, get it because if you don't, when you come back to get it, you're not going to be able to find it. So he got two packs of the super glue five minute quick setting epoxy got two of those gotta love epoxy gotta love epoxy because epoxy you with the moxie you can't just go out in the woods and pull this off of a tree he also grabbed a pack of these toothbrush cover travel thingy my bobbers and i am going you just to... bought some of these why did you no, buy I didn't. more no i didn't buy them remember i put them up I seem to recall hauling them. Well, you didn't. I put those up. I want them like that so that I can put them in there, and then it's small and it's compact, and I can just get a stick and stick in there and use it for a toothbrush out in the woods, and I don't have to carry a whole toothbrush or a pot. I'm got an <laughs> I've got an image of you with a stick and a toothbrush going, <laughs> and the stick breaking, and you're like, never mind. The things he does. I don't know, guys. If it makes him happy, okay? That's all I care about. If it makes you if happy. If it makes you happy. So, as you probably, maybe, most likely know, Hubby uh, teaches at a gym, local gym. He teaches his Aikido. And so he has to clean the mats. And so he buys the stinky cleaner. I like this stuff. I don't like this cleaner. Now, this is, this is a good... Um, public service announcement because when we got home and he took it out of the bag it came out of the bag like this thankfully there's a seal on it but always make sure your caps are nice and secure and even just now that was not on there very well like it's I not barely on very well. had to turn it so anyway he got that for the Rojo the other day he needed an ink pen and we're out of them. And we're like out of just basic black ink pens. Did you have to seriously think about which cup you're going to drink out of? The empty one or the... No. One with the, you seriously looked at like with your hand No, in the what air. happened was the, the, the Kleenexes was in front of my cup. And I was debating on whether I wanted to move the Kleenexes and take the cup. Or whether I wanted to go around it and grab it. And <laughs> I love you. <laughs> so anyway, we grabbed an eight pack of pens. Part of the reason that we were out of just basic pens is because, like I said, our stores have been bare. Like, it's been crazy. And I should have taken a picture of this to show you guys uh, two things. Real quick, one thing about it, then I'll show you the best item that we found of the day. Um, number one, I truly think that part of the problem with supply in these stores has been... Bye. Supply lines, yeah, Biden's bull crap, and the supply lines breaking down. Cause I saw stuff in our store for Val or for um, Thanksgiving for fall time that hadn't been in our stores yet from last fall that I saw people hauling last fall, and now they're just now hitting our stores here. It's March, like literally almost a year later. It's ridiculous. So anyway, um. I will say I was super stoked to find this item. Well, Hubby actually found it. It was up at the registers, sitting in a box. And, baby, can you go get your ring? It's on our um, TV stand. Hey, you want these? No, it's on our TV stand. Because Hubby's ring, wedding band, he had to take off because it was, it was just too small. And it was actually, excuse me, cutting off circulation. That's not true. The reason I had to take it off was because my girlfriend was getting really pissed that I kicked my ring on when... <laughs> well, anyway, his ring no longer it fits him. It does not fit. Oh, my gosh. And thankfully, we were able to get it off of him. It was hard. Because it's titanium. I don't even know how they would cut it. Like, mm -hmm. I don't know how you would cut titanium. But we found these. Yes. Like, super, super stoked. So, there's... They are silicone rings. These are the size large. Fits 11 and a half to 5. And it's a 5 pack. Uh, the brand name on it is Every Ring. Super, super stoked. Hold on, honey. He's over here trying to grab for them. So you've got a blue one, 
a camo, a black, a gray, and like a goldish. Yeah. These colors are not coming up right. It's there you gold. go. It's yeah. gold, gray, black, camo. It's got green on it. If we can, there you go. You can see the green, and then the blue. Which one you want me to so, wear? So that is up to you, my love. The rest of them we'll put in my jewelry box. They'll be safe and sound and not lost Let's forever. Let's see here. We got this. five of them. Yep, you got five to choose from. So, so well, this is what we'll do. I'll put two and one. Let's just get. We'll get two and one, and three in the other. All right, hold on, guys. Okay, okay. okay. So I've got three rings in one hand and two rings in the other. You pick one. And I'll get rid of the other side, and then we'll keep. Okay. Well, you picked that one. It had the three. So we'll get rid of these two. Oh man, I was getting those. All right. So now we're gonna now we're gonna get down to two and one. Pick. I can't see. Oh ah, there we got rid of that one. So the ring I'm wearing is the gray one. Nice. So well, that's a little big. It on is that. a little big, but it it'll it'll work. That's it'll it. work. It, But they'll do for now. They'll do for now. And if we need to downsize you a little bit, we can. But for a dollar twenty-five, because I was looking at them on Amazon, and it's like thirteen dollars for basically the same thing. So anyway. But I am um, marked again. <laughs> yeah, he's branded again. Branded. I. Uh, yeah, they're all the same. Size. See, my nomies. I got them set up for this video, and then I didn't even have them in the video. But anyway, um, yeah, I just. Where do you want these to sit? Um, just put them where you found this okay. and then I'll put them in my jewelry box so anyway that is the his portion of the his and hers Dollar Tree hauls thank you guys so much for watching please don't forget to like comment and subscribe and I'll see you in the next video in the next video loves and hugs bye